20 jobs that won't be around in the near future. It seems like something out of a science fiction book or dystopian novel about the future. But make no mistake, the job market as we know it is bound to completely transform. Some jobs may actually even become obsolete in the future. Today, we're going to go over some jobs that might not be around in the future. But first, we can guarantee that we'll be around in the future. So why don't you click subscribe and hit that notification bell as well? Because if you don't, our writers won't be around for much longer. Number one, gas station workers. With electric cars becoming more and more popular, the need for gas station workers may soon become less and less. Between theft in poorer areas and the rise in gas prices, the industry may soon shift entirely to clean, reusable energy. This means many gas stations may be replaced by recharging stations, where you simply drive up, plug in your vehicle, and then drive off. Number 2. Pharmacy Workers Giving out the wrong prescriptions, failure to communicate the appropriate prescriptions, and human substance abuse may be more closely monitored if all these tasks are performed by a robot. Yes, believe it or not, the way you receive your prescription drugs may radically be altered in the future. A lot of these types of jobs are target of automation. Number 3. Bank Tellers Bank error in your favor. Collect $200. Well, not anymore. Yes, even bank tellers are subject to losing their positions in the future. After all, it's hard to rob a bank if it's run by robots. This may also happen to loan officers who may not give away loans anymore based on charity. If you don't make the cut, then you don't qualify. It's hard to argue with a faceless machine to give you money. Number 4. Industry Workers Car manufacturers Cell phone manufacturers and many different workers in various industries are at risk of being replaced by robotic arms. In 2016, tech company Foxconn replaced 60,000 of its workers with robots. This is happening across the board with many different manufacturing companies, making industry workers the most likely to lose their careers. Number 5. Grocery Store Clerks we are already starting to see this at big box grocery stores and department stores around the world. Scanning coupons, inputting your own purchases, and paying a machine seems to be the norm. It may even prove to eliminate cashiers altogether. Given that nearly 10% of all cash handling transactions result in a human error, which may result in losses for either the company finances or the customers. Number 6. Pilots Eliminating human error is actually a large component of creating vehicles that run entirely on autopilot. Many planes actually run on these types of systems, with a human in the pilot seat making sure everything goes as planned. Perhaps these types of vehicles can be controlled entirely by a computer in the future. Number 7. Postal Workers Paper mail delivery has been on a steady decline over the past few decades with the invention of email. Electronic delivery has cut paper costs, saved trees, and even taken out the lost mail equation altogether. Many services resort to online billing, and when it comes to parcel delivery, companies like Amazon are starting to employ delivery drones. The whole process has not been streamlined yet, but it's only a matter of time before home mail delivery becomes obsolete. Number 8. Truck Drivers Many of the world's leading businesses are starting to invest in driverless vehicles, especially trucks including Apple, Tesla, 
Ford, Amazon, and even Uber. Delivery times can be doubled without the need for humans to stop to use the bathroom, sleep, or eat. Now, trucks can be fueled and travel straight to their destinations without stopping. This will greatly affect many companies' bottom lines, but it will ultimately cost truck drivers their careers in the future. Number 9. Teachers It may come as a shock that teachers are subject to becoming obsolete. However, many academics agree that new technologies like iPads and personal computers can be used to teach children just as well. Engaging applications, programs, and even video tutorials can teach many people how to do things themselves. Perhaps in the future, schools may become at-home guided programs through virtual reality, as portrayed in Ernest Cline's novel Ready Player One. Number 10. Public Transit Drivers or Operators Bus drivers, subway drivers, and train operators may soon lose their jobs to automation as well. With the invention of driverless vehicles, many workers in these positions might soon find their jobs to be obsolete, as the need for a human operator is gone. Number 11. Baristas Getting a perfectly handcrafted cup of coffee may soon be a thing of the past with espresso machines becoming more and more advanced in the coming years. According to Wikipedia, over 2.5 billion cups of coffee are consumed every day. In the future, coffee shops may actually become coffee stations where people line up to have a cup of joe pumped out of a machine. Number 12. Fast Food Workers McDonald's and other fast food chains are already replacing their cashiers with ordering stations. These computers allow you to punch in your order manually, pay, and then receive your order. How much longer will it be before a computer with robotic arms is made to assemble hamburgers like an automotive plant assembles cars? This may happen sooner than we think. Number 13. Meter readers. A meter reader is someone who goes around to the houses for gas and electric companies to get accurate readouts of the utility bills. Well, they were, at least. Nowadays, most companies are installing text to access the information remotely. Number 14. Typist or word processor. Some of our grandmas might have worked as a typist back in the age of typewriters, and we honestly assumed that the profession had already gone up to that great job hunting site in the sky. But the rise of automated transcription software has been a key factor in the job's recent decline. Number 15. Broadcasters Add broadcasting to the list of industries that millennials are ruthlessly killing. Because 20-somethings are constantly on their daggum social media devices, ad revenue from TV is going down, so TV news companies may find it more difficult to hire. Number 16. Disc Jockeys CareerCast explains that declining job prospects for DJs by saying that people are opting to use their iTunes and Spotify playlists instead. We mean, we guess that's an option, but don't come crying to me when your Frick the Haters playlist comes on during your cousin's bar mitzvah. Number 17. Seamstress, tailors, and jewelers. Because we as a society have decided that clothing is essentially disposable, as is the workforce that makes it, fewer people are opting to get their clothing well tailored. For the same reason, Jewelers are expected to see their industry reduced by 11%. We're not bitter about how wasteful and exploitive Western society's clothing purchasing practices are, we say, bitterly, with a bitter expression. Number 18. Insurance Underwriter We're going to be honest. Our collective brains here at Bestie just short-circuited automatically 
when we expected to understand insurance, but apparently, underwriters are responsible for evaluating whether or not an insurance company should take on someone as their client. In recent years, underwriting software has made the job stability what those in the business might call an uninsurable risk. Number 19. Computer Programmer Remember how everyone's parents and teachers told them to go into STEM fields to gain some possibility of a stable job? Well, let's hope you didn't actually listen to them because computer programmers in the US aren't projected to do well over the next few years. While we'll still probably be using computers by 2025, companies have started to hire from countries where the wages are lower. Hooray for globalization! Number 20. Librarian Whether you had one in your school or you were just a nerd who frequented the library often, we usually have fond memories of librarians, but alas, those memories will be but stories for distant generations because librarians are disappearing. Why, you ask? Well, that's because libraries are disappearing as well. We know this sucks, but why would someone need a room full of manual books when you have a library of digitally obtained books at your fingertips? Still, those of us who liked getting media you can hold in your hands for free are going to miss these bastions of learning. Plus, it was probably the last place besides a public toilet where you could go hang out without being expected to buy anything. And that concludes our list. Were you surprised of any of the jobs that might not exist soon? Was your job included on this list? Let us know in the comment section below all of your questions, comments, and concerns about the future. Enjoyed this video? Hit the like button and share with your friends. Also, subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching.